Hello, I have a doll haul for you today. I went clearance shopping, I went to Walmart, Goodwill, Target, Ross. So, I found Michelle St. Charles on clearance for $9. She says, what series is this? Five or something? I don't know if it says anymore, but um, she was the only one. There was none of the other ones, because I think the other ones were on clearance, too. But $9. Her boots are amazing. <laughs> and she's cute. So, her lip is a little weird. That's okay. $9. Alright. Then, that was at... One of the Walmarts. I'm going to show you the other Rainbow High first so I can get them in the background. This was at Ross, though. I check Ross sometimes. <laughs> um, because sometimes they have, you know, discounted stuff. So, I've been tracking these down at Grocery Outlets. And I got Daria at Grocery Outlet. Cheryl was actually the first one that I found. And then I did find Gabby. So, I got Emmy now. lips look cute. I don't know if I'm gonna keep these in box or I don't like that this is on there. I'm gonna use a hairdryer or something and get that off because they're just cute but because they have no articulation they're just not that fun to play around with I guess. So i push her, use her friend to push her back there. <laughs> and then I got Georgia Bloom. Now, these were the only two there. They had a bunch of Darias, like five Darias, and only one of Emmy and one of Georgia. So, who knows if they had more, but look at Georgia. She's so cute. So cute. A little peachy outfit. She's got little tennis shoes on down there. But, yeah. So, they were $14.99. It says regular price $19. Yeah, no. Right? These are... At, these are supposed to be like $15 dolls, right? Because at Grocery Outlet, they're $15. But. Yeah, so that's my Rainbow High. I was excited. Now I only need Daphne out of that series. So I was excited about that. All right, what else did I find? I'm I mean, I found some stuff, but not like, not like a ton. Okay, I grabbed one of these. Now... These have reduced down to $5.97 at the my local Walmarts. I've been waiting and waiting for them to go lower because there's tons. But I'm hoping that these are Poppy's boots because they're like the only pair of shoes that I don't have, I think. So I thought I'd try, take a chance. And then, technically that was on clearance. Just And then I found some more of these. These were not on clearance. They're like the mini brand series three or something that he runs fashion and so I grabbed her they're just gonna roll away three of those because I'm addicted to these little mini fashion purses so another one rolled away and I did buy a pair of my life boots because they were cute and these are only like I had a ton of shoes they're all very similar to ones I already have I think I have a similar pair that has fabric on the top like this, but it's pink. But they're just cute. I don't think they have a left and right, but I don't know. Sorry, I'm not even showing them to you. Look. Like fabric on the boots. I just think it's really cute. So I got those for my 18-inch dolls. I have a couple Journey Girls in my life ones. Okay, now... I went to, I got these at Target, and there was, there wasn't, I must have missed the Target clearance, there just was not much. Man, this was Walmart, this was Walmart, Walmart, Ross, okay, and then this was Goodwill. Okay, so that one's rolling away. Get back there. All right, so they didn't have much. You never know when you go there. You, I mean, so there was this bag, it didn't have a price, so she gave it to me for $3.99, and then I had a coupon for half off one item, so I got it for $1.99, so $2. Nothing too exciting. There was a Moana in there. She's articulated. She has her shirt. Um, 
I know I have a Moana doll. So I'll have to see if I want to keep her or not. I'm not sure. I didn't buy the bag for her. And then there was a Sparkle Girl. I don't know what happened to this poor thing. Um, I'm not going to keep her. And then I bought the bag for this lady. It is, ooh, my shoe. I believe it's a bell. I think it's a metal bell. But her body is similar to a Mycene body. Pretty sure. Yeah, 1990 Mattel. I think the Mycene had this body with the bend knees. Yeah. So I bought her to just be a spare body. Oh, she has pretty curls. I feel sad ripping her head off, but, you know, sometimes you get a head or you get a Mycene that needs a body. And yeah, so she's going to be a body donor. Um, and then there's some Disney shoes. Those sort of look like Mara, Maribel shoes. Yeah, like this one looks like a Maribel shoe. Hmm. And then like maybe an Ariel shoe. Did I even show those to you? I'm looking at them like down here. <laughs> oh my goodness, I'm sorry. I have a bad habit of not looking in the camera all the time to make sure things are in focus for you. Here, we'll tip that down a little bit. Okay, then there was... Well, she put it in here. This doll has been there for weeks. She was in a bag all by herself for $1.99, I think, or $2.99, something like that. And I thought about getting her just because I love Ariel. And she's like, I think like a Disney store version, I think. Her hair is just voluminous. I mean, she had her top and her tail. And she looks to be in okay condition. Pretty good. So, she was cute. And she was just laying there for and with a $1.99 sticker. I'm like, okay, I guess you're meant to be. Because I've looked at her so many times and thought about getting her. But I just didn't. Because I'm not too big into collecting the Disney dolls. But I do particularly love Ariel. Because her movie, The Little Mermaid, came out when I was a kid. And I watched it every day one summer. So, Ariel. Then, this bag was $2.99. There was just two dolls in it. I did not get it for this little fashionista who has had a haircut. Poor thing. She has a little cute top and some pants and boots, though. So, But I did not get it for her. I got the bag for this doll. Now, she has on an LOLMG skirt I'm taking off because I want to look at her body. Um, wow, she's really loose. But again, I think she, her body, potentially, 2003, what here does it say? 2000. Nine? Hmm. Maybe. I thought her body could potentially be a Mycene donor body. I didn't realize how loose she was in the bag. Um, yeah. But, you know, she has a pretty Barbie face. Her hair's kind of clon. It also looks like it was cut. But, yeah, I'll see what I can do here. I might just put her... Like, put these bodies aside for a just-in-case of my scenes. Because this could be Barbie. And this one maybe could be Chelsea or Nolie's skin tone. Alright. I think that's it. Thanks for watching.